सिंह लाइव वायर एन आई एम स्वाति जोशी कॉन्ट्रोवर्शियल भारतीय जनता पार्टी एमएलए टी राजा सिंह वॉज सस्पेंडेड फ्रॉम द पार्टी आवर्स आफ्टर ही वॉज अरेस्टेड फॉर अलेजेडली मेकिंग डेरोगेटरी रिमार्क्स अगेंस्ट प्रॉफिट मोहम्मद द पार्टी ऑल्सो गेव सिंह अ शो कॉज नोटिस फॉर टेन डेज आस्किंग हिम टू एक्सप्लेन वाई ही शुड नॉट बी एक्सपेल्ड एन एफ आई आर वॉज रजिस्टर्ड अगेंस्ट द गोशा महल एमएलए आफ्टर प्रोटेस्ट इराप्टेड एट सेवरल लोकेशन इन हैदराबाद इंक्लूडिंग द साउथ ईस्ट एंड वेस्ट जोन डिमांडिंग एक्शन अगेंस्ट हिम So the Bharatiya Janata Party MLA has been uh, suspended from the party he was first arrested so after legal action disciplinary action was taken by the BJP remember uh, BJP suspended Nupur Sharma as well now in the letter that has been issued the BJP has not just uh, suspended uh, T Raja but also given him a 10 day ultimatum to explain his position BJP claims that uh, T Raja Singh has been suspended because he has time and again taken stands which are contrary to the party's views and that is the reason why he has been suspended 10 day time has been given to him to explain himself to convince the party as to why he should not be expelled t raja singh mla from gosha mahal had uh, in a video online given uh, derogatory comments alleged derogatory comments against prophet mohammed post which several protests took place across hyderabad and he was later arrested All right we are moving on now BJP has suspended the Telangana MLA after his offensive statement but uh, AIMIM has still not acted against either Imtiaz Jalil or against the AIMIM corporator who was seen raising the Sir Tanse Juda chants first it was Imtiaz Jalil who gave a call to behead Nupur Sharma and then it is uh, a corporator named Zafar Khan who raised the Sir Tanse Juda slogan the big question is will OAC now sack him taken no action against either imtiaz jalil or this corporator in fact uh, today on times now mr ovc was confronted on the issue of beheading call given by imtiaz jalil but he evaded times now's question let's take a look at this sequence sir an open call was given to hang nupur sharma thank you madam thank you thank you thank you thank you madam thank you thank you thank you go i, I have to, to play out that sound bite I, I, if you can just respond to this because you just asked times now for you 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 can do it you can do it but you, i have to go to the channel let us show you what imtiaz jalil said one answer sir and then you can thank go you. small request sir bol le yaar tum 5 minute karo na piche se mala ra piche se mr ovesi can you hear me Mr. Ovesi, we're playing out that uh, reaction of Imtiaz Jalil. You just put out that question two times. Now you said that's not what he said, but we have it, sir. We have the proof with us, and I want a response from you. Let's go across to Samit now. Samit, uh, Mr. Ovesi asked for proof, and when Times Now was informing about the proof, which was on camera, he chose to. run away he chose to evade our questions but now another neta of his party was uh, caught on camera raising the sar tan se juda slogans today mr ovc has condemned those slogans so will action be taken well i could i couldn't hear your question can you please repeat So Amit, uh, Mr. Ovesi today condemned A, uh, uh, T Raja's comments along with the Sir Tan Se Juda slogans. But his own corporator, Zafar Khan, on camera was uh, heard 
raising those slogans will an action be taken is the big question Well, that is where the uh, question raises, actually, you know, because, uh, you know, Asaduddin Awasi was, since the beginning, was, has said that I condemn all the statements or the slogans given by the party leaders or the public uh, against uh, Nupur Sharma or uh, Raja Singh, because, you know, uh, after the blasphemous statements, he is in police custody now, even the BJP party has uh, suspended him, and when Shoko's notice has been issued, and uh, even Asaduddin Awasi has said that, uh, you know, I condemn uh, these statements, and BJP uh, has, uh, you know, made uh, official, uh, it's, it's, it's an official uh, purpose that you know they are doing it uh, intentionally and uh, you know they wanted uh, uh, to mainly you know uh, rake up the communal issues across the state uh, only for one bipole that is what the, exactly they said uh, exactly as it said and when we posed the question that uh, why uh, you know you, you, you haven't initiated any action on Mtia Jalil your MP uh, who has uh, said uh, to behead uh, Nupur Sharma and now a cooperator after lodging a complaint at a local police station the Zafar Khan uh, of uh, you know uh, Malipali uh, uh, cooperator from the MIM party he has uh, stated that, you know, uh, Sir Tansi Judah uh, should be done. Uh, that exactly means even Raja Singh should be beheaded. And, uh, you know, we have asked to pose this question to Asadhin Ovesi, but uh, he hasn't uh, he has remained silent and he hasn't uh, replied anything to that. And uh, he only said that I condemn all the statements, but not even action initiated at that time when Imtia Jalil has given that statement slogan. And now no action has been initiated on the cooperator who has given, uh, you know, this, this slogan. But on the other hand, he has demanded stringent action should be initiated against Raja Singh by the state government, well, by the government. Has been taken. He has Voice been arrested, plus BJP has suspended him as well. Isn't it time for Mr. OAC to do the same? If he is against such slogans being raised, if he is against such uh, provocative statements being given. So, let's stay on with us. Let's listen to a couple of reactions. In Nipur Sharma, when I was the Pradhan Mantri, 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 I was the तो ये उसी की उपज है उसी की वजह से ऐसा होता है और इसी तरह दूसरे लोग भी एक दूसरे की प्रथा डाल रहे लेकिन ये देश के लिए प्रथा अच्छी नहीं है ये देश दुनिया में इसलिए पहचाना जाता है जो सभी धर्म गुरुओं का सम्मान करता है कम से कम अब इतना तो मानेंगे कि कार्रवाई तो हुई है गिरफ्तारी हो गई है ज्यादा आप थोड़ा बहुत जांच पड़ताल में वक्त तो ना अब क्या मुकदमा है क्योंकि मुझे अभी आपकी उससे जानकारी लगी है लेकिन कितना सीरियस क्योंकि ये एक बहुत ऐसी बात है जो हम लोगों के लिए नाकाबिल बर्दाश्त है जो बिल्कुल बर्दाश्त नहीं की जा सकती तो ऐसे पे क्या एक्शन लिया गया कौन सी धाराएं ली गई है ये मैं अभी आपको नहीं बता सकता लेकिन अगर गंभीर उन्होंने अपराध दर्ज करा और गिरफ्तारी करी है तो वास्तव में ठीक है और अगर नहीं करी तो करना चाहिए जिस तरीके से तेलंगाना के एक एम ने पैगम्बर सल्लाम की शान में गुस्ताखी करने की कोशिश की है उसकी हम लोग सख्त अल्फाज में मजम्मत करते हैं और हुकूमत से डिमांड करते हैं कि उसके खिलाफ सख्त से सख्त कानूनी कार्रवाई की जाए और इसीलिए बार बार हुकूमत से ये मुतालबा किया जा रहा है कि सेंट्रल लेवल पर एक ऐसा सख्त कानून बनाया जाए जिसके तहत अगर कोई भी शख्स किसी भी मजहब या किसी भी मजहबी पर्सनैलिटी के खिलाफ कोई बात कहता है तो उसके खिलाफ सख्त कानूनी कार्रवाई की जाए Let's go back to Somit who continues to be with us. Somit, uh, well, in case of T. Raja, we saw the legal action being taken first. He was arrested. But what about uh, this AIMIM corporator? Has a complaint been filed by anyone? Has someone approached the police? Well, no complaint has been filed and uh, we have asked uh, Union Home, uh, Union uh, uh, Cultural Minister Kishan Reddy about the statements, you know, about the slogans and the statements given by the AIMM leaders and he has said that, you know, we condemn it and uh, no one should give the, those kind of uh, slogans and uh, even we have asked the assets, you know, I see, will you initiate any action? He remained silent and uh, he didn't, uh, you know, uh, uh, utter a word about it and uh, he only said that we condemn it and on the other hand, uh, we are trying to speak to the police because no complaint has been registered. Already we spoke to the police. They said that as of now, we haven't received any complaint. If we receive any complaint, an university probe will be launched into that matter. But as of now, no complaint has been filed. Only, I know, the backlash can be seen by the BJP party uh, stating that because the action has been initiated on the other hand, on our hand, uh, then uh, on the other hand too, when where Ramam is alleging that BJP has made it its exclusive policy, its, uh, you know, uh, its policy that uh, to, uh, 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 you know, make derogatory statements on against uh, Prophet Muhammad, then he should also initiate action against the leaders who, have, who are openly coming out and saying to behead the leaders, uh, B, you know, uh, former BJP leaders, and uh, you know, action should be initiated against them. That is what we are hearing from the BJP as of now, but nothing yet from the uh, AIMM party. All right, Swami, thank you very much for getting us those details. We're moving on now. We have breaking inputs coming in from Purulia in 